What's going on guys? Coming at you with a real quick video for you. This one is actually going to be how to change your fonts on your iDevices. Um, for this video I'm going to be using my iPhone 4 and uh, the package that you're going to want to install is called Bitafont. And just to give you a little preview of what this does, it actually goes ahead and changes the system fonts um, for everything on your phone. As you can see here I have typed in my notes application Bitafont. That is the package you will get from Cydia. And as you can see, it has changed. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Go ahead and uh, click on Cydia. As you can see it loading up its data, you will also notice that, uh, yeah, like I said, it changed the fonts uh, for everything. So you're going to go down to the bottom right hand corner, click on search, top of the search bar. You're going to want to type in Byta font, which is B Y T A. And, uh, yeah, so it pops right up. It's from Mod My Eye. You can actually download that straight from the source if you'd like. Top right hand corner, click to install. Top right hand corner again to go ahead and confirm. And uh, it will um, give you a new icon on your home screen. Also, if you want, you can uh, get a Bita font font pack, or you can simply uh, type in. Uh, fonts in your uh, search bar here, which it's not wanting me to do. <laughs> All right, there we go. Yeah, just go ahead and type in fonts and uh, click search, and you will see a bunch of different options. The ones that uh, are going to be compatible with Bita font are the ones that have the question marks, usually from Mod My Eye. So, uh, yeah, you can click on whichever one you'd like. Uh, this one is the Amsterdam Graffiti. Go ahead, click on install. Top right hand corner again to confirm. And that's it. Exit out of it. Go into your uh, Bita font icon. Click on it. And whichever font you choose uh, to apply, click on that. A little pop up box will come up and let you know that uh, Respring is required to continue. So go ahead and apply it and Respring. And um, yeah, once you. Uh, once you come back and uh, go into anything, you will notice uh, that your even even your uh, status bar, your time, your date, uh, everything has changed to whichever font you'd like. Um, just want to mention real quick, the uh, the guy who um, actually told me about this font. This one is the Pyrulean font. A uh, good buddy of mine, uh, Apple and Blackberry. He's also the guy that um, created uh, my layout on my uh, new channel on YouTube. So guys, if you haven't already, <clears throat> go ahead and uh, check out my channel, swing by, check out the new layout. Um, really, really great work from a really cool guy, all-around guy. I'll go ahead and leave his uh, information down in the uh, link description. And uh, yeah, make sure you guys uh, check him out, follow him on Twitter, check out his channel as well. And as always, guys, if you like the video, give me a thumbs up, uh, leave me some comments down below. And as always, click up top for subscribe. And until the next video, I'll catch you guys later.